hello friends welcome back to our channel and let's see today uh, how we can create role and users into a snowflake right and assign roles to user so let's uh, that syntax we are, which we are going to use that create or replace role uh, with my new role whatever name we want to provide for role and that is how we create that role now what kind of permission we want to give to new role maybe sys admin we can add right maybe uh, whatever depending upon your needs need which warehouse has permission that new role will have which warehouse permission what is the uses rights on this which database we want to provide grant that okay uses he can see on all the schema in the database test db grant uses all the functions right in the database test db we can go if you want to add all the procedures uses then this can be done right if you want to go for select all the table in the test db that user can do that we can give that permission also if we want to give that uh, select all the view then also that permission we can give if you want to give the usage and write in all the stages we make into this uh, database then we can give if you want to give that role for all the future schema which we are going to create or maybe in future we will create we can give the access we can give that future function which is going to be created by someone or procedure in that uh, in future which we are going to create and future table if any table is right now not project but in future we are going to create in this db we can give that one similar to if anybody wants to will create the future in views anything we can give the access all the future stages we can give the access now if we see that role is created and how to grant different accesses to that role how to create user create user we can do with the password is specified and create user statement what is the default role we can give or if user has to change the password very first time we can give the details right also without default role we can go and later we can um, alter that grant role to user uh, whatever uh, role we want to provide we can also alter the password and set a new password uh, to that user any user we can also if we want to reset password that password we can reset and this this is that url we can share with that guy or that user that go ahead and change the password so that way we can do also we can uh, if some so somehow it is disabled that user got disabled by trying wrong password we can disable equal we can disable it also and then disable equals to false also we can enable that one also right we can also that uh, minimum time to unlock change the settings that if we want to change the setting for uh, any user we can do that one <clears throat> if we want to change any other settings like okay let's keep the client session alive don't log, log out anything that we can do also if you want to change the last name of user we can do that one if you want to see that uh, details about users then also we can see what is the different uh, default user details are there that property james smith whatever password uh, in the must change password disabled or not day to expiry every detail we can see for that user and finally if you want to drop user we can use the drop user command and we can drop that so this is two things we wanted to see that how it is working into snowflake and i hope that that will be useful to you also someday thank you